In the previous video, we looked at how to use a WHERE clause to narrow down your search results. However, we looked at a very simple use case where we used only one condition in WHERE clause. In most of your real cases, you'll need to narrow down your search results based on multiple conditions. In this video, I will show you how you can use two most commonly used operators and an OR to add multiple conditions in WHERE clause. So let's go to BigQuery and see this in action. Let's build on the query that we wrote in the previous video. Here we have select star, meaning all columns, from this table. So the table name is your project name, your data set name, and the table name. Together, this makes the complete table name where event name is equal to generate lead, which narrows down our result set to only those records where event name is equal to generate lead. Now let's say you want to only focus on desktop users. So you want to look at generate lead records, but only for those users who did that event on desktop. In order to do that, you will have to append another criteria to this statement. The way you do that is by using AND operator. So go ahead and enter and add AND. Now you need another column and the value. So we know that we want to look at users who came from desktop. So let's go ahead and find a column where we can see if the user came from mobile or desktop. Scrolling further, here is a column that shows mobile. Let's see if this is the right column. And here is device category, mobile, desktop, mobile, 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 desktop. So this is the right column. Let's go ahead and add this column. So and device category, and then equal to Remember, your strings have to be within single quotes. And then I have to find the value. So I'm going to copy this. I could have written desktop here as well and paste it. That's it. Now, when I run this query, it will show me only those records where event name is generate lead and device category is desktop. So let's go ahead and run it. And here, let's see, it's all generate lead. And scrolling further, we can see it's all desktop. So you use the AND criteria to combine two conditions. Result set will show only those records which meet both those conditions. Now let's take a look at another condition. This time, we want to look at all the records where we generated a lead or where the user purchased something. In order to do that, you will use another operator called OR. So how do you write that? I'm going to remove this AND condition and instead I will write OR event name equal to purchase. So now a result set will contain records that either have the event name as generate lead or event name is purchase. Go ahead and click on run. And let's take a look at these records. Here you have generate lead, generate lead, generate lead, generate lead. And here's your purchase. So that's how you combine multiple criteria using AND and OR. You can have multiple AND and OR conditions to get to your desired result. Now it's your turn to practice multiple AND and OR conditions. The more you practice, the better you'll become. And I will see you in the next video.